Welcome to day one of OIHA uh, 2025. We are delighted to be at the Starkey booth. You can feel the excitement in the air and the energy. So come on, let's take a quick tour. At the DNN 360 station, we have the opportunity for participants to listen to the way that we can preserve the best signal to noise ratio while also enabling that spatial awareness to locate where the sound is. We say around here, hearing is believing, and I believe. The best hearing aid isn't the best if it can't survive the real world. And what we've got here is a demonstration of our efforts that we put in to make our shells stronger, new resin material for all custom and devices, and we can subject that to our own little torture test area here. We can make sure that our receiver cables are the strongest in the industry by hanging five pound weight uh, on these devices and hanging on there without breaking that Kevlar reinforcement while also providing pliability that makes it easy to get the device centered and put in the ear properly. And then our water immersion. Uh, we don't cheat on the IP rating test. The IP68, we exceed being able to be suspended in a column of water for 30 minutes, take it out, dry it off, and use it. I put my devices in a column of water, left them streaming for a half an hour, they still work. We're not encouraging people to take their hearing aids scuba diving, but they can jump in the shower, they can uh, jump in the pool, and if they forget their devices, no harm, no foul. We also give the opportunity for professionals to have some hands-on with the ProFit fitting software that will be used to program Omega AI, as well as my Starkey uh, user application for Android and iPhones. One thing that I really like, especially at OIHA like this, is I can use Find My Fabry um, to have someone locate me if I'm, if I'm in the booth somewhere and they don't know where I'm at. All I need to do is turn my lights on and they'll be able to find me. We have a lot of exciting things that we're going to be showcasing over the next couple days. I'm your on-site reporter, Dave Fabry, signing off.